fishing here on the kayak. Um, don't really bring much to this spot because you can't really throw much. It has to be either weedless or a frog. I think I'm going to start with either a popping frog. This is a new one I just got. It's a lunker hunt popping frog compared to the spros I usually throw. It's pretty similar. But um, it's one that has really sharp hooks. So I'm, I'm going to try this one. My other rod I throw like a soft plastic weedless which I might throw this new Eliminator lure from Mystery Tackle Box. Um, I kind of like that. That's the package there. And I'm bringing some on there to swim baits and flukes and stuff. But mostly it's going to be a frog thing going on. And I just bring a couple extra frogs. Got a duck. Whatever. I like the popping frogs. Shout out to the dude. I, I didn't get your name, but shout out to the guy who I was uh, talking to back at the bridge it says he watches my videos appreciate it buddy forgot to get your name sorry all right let's get to the star of the show it's the frog and I and this is new that lunker hunt popping frog I am going straight braid hopefully it doesn't burn me usually I do run like a 30 pound liter back here all right, so it casts good. Looks like it floats pretty well. Nice pop. Yeah, this will be just fine. Today would have been a great day to go flounder fish on my kayak. Great weather, but it's Memorial Day. And the beach is insane, so I'm not messing with it. I'm staying up north, man. And a big thank you to anybody who serves. Appreciate appreciate you. But the beaches are insane. I heard they actually closed down the drive-on beaches. That's how bad it was yesterday. Get like this. Water's getting cleaner back as farther further we go back. So that's good. There he is! We got him boys! We got him! I knew he'd be back there. Ah, oh, don't come off. Oh, it's a bass! Wow! A nice bass! I grabbed my net. I think it was. I thought that was a snakehead for sure. Woo! It's a welcome sight. Fat little bass, dude. He crushed that thing. Look how perfect and healthy he is. Sweet. Oh. Man, I wish I didn't net him. I thought it was a snakehead. I'm all tangled up now. What a pretty fish. Sweet. I grabbed my net. I was like, snake? 100% thought that was a snakehead back in there. I saw him splash. He looked long. He was that was, a, that was a nice bass. Very happy with that. So this is that lunker hunt frog. It works. I like it. It's doing its job. It has really sharp hooks, and the hooks are a little bit more narrow than those spros. So I don't know. Maybe that will help with hookups. I don't know. Let's sneak back here a little bit. Gotta be quiet. Ah, get away from the blogs. Gross. 
guarantee you nobody's fished here in a long time. Probably just, probably just me, honestly. Oh, there's something following it. That was a snakehead. Oh. A snakehead was following it, or a pike. That was big. Damn. He had it. He had it. Can just see tons of fish. Seems more shallow back here. Oh, a bass came up and ate it. <laughs> I saw him come up and eat it. All right, guys, I just switched it up to a little, uh, just went back to the regular Spro skipping frog, the popping frog. It was getting hits, but it was just getting caught up in all this grass too much. This should stay on top a little bit better. And I think we're going to catch something back here for sure. Like that. First cast, it's pretty small, totally missed it. Dude, definitely just saw a family of otters in Delaware. Hoping they pop back up. Like 100% otters, they were not beavers. Never saw them back here. I heard they were back here. Saw pictures. I'm a believer now. And they've, they've been underwater for a long time. Oh my god. It's an otter. That's definitely an otter. Nice, my GoPro was on. Oh, there he is. It's a freaking otter in Delaware. All right, how about a family of snakeheads so I can have dinner? <clears throat> All right, went back to Old Faithful here. Just a spro, popping frog, black. It's got a lot of confidence in it. We need to catch something. I know I came at a bad time, just the middle of the day, but I mean, it's 12.48 right now. <clears throat> Usually you can catch them all day. Just need one to eat it and just stick them. We had hits. They miss it, man. It happens a lot. Oh, that snakehead right there. I can see him. Oh! First time I ever saw, saw a snakehead just chilling in the water. He saw my boat. I can't with this wind, man. So I'm gonna paddle back. Oh, 
that's a nice ba nice bass floating bus swimming by. There's two nice bass right here. There's one. Oh, that's a nice bass. That's a big bass. He came off. Dude. Oh, I should have netted him. Wow. I didn't net him because it was just a bass. Probably should have though. Damn it. Right back here in this muck. I saw him just swim off. He was like a three and a half pounder. Nice bass. Ugh. God damn it. <laughs> Open this bale. Got him. Man, don't you hate when you're snakehead fishing and you just keep smashing nice chunky bass? All right. That's cool. Man, I think it was vicious. Well, at least we caught another one back here. Tell you what, man, this muck is the key. He just totally slimed my shit. guys I'm gonna, I'm gonna call it here um no snakeheads we're not doing too well on snakeheads this year i don't know what's going on but, uh, we caught some nice bass had that one real nice one pop off of the boat but um yeah it was fun saw some otters that was crazy but uh yeah man thanks for watching hope you guys like it and uh, i'll catch you on the next one man thank you